Hello everyone, I am Shen Xin from Nanyang Technology University. Today, I will introduce our work, Prototype Feature Extraction for Multitask Learning. This work is supported by Nanyang Technology University and Kuaishou Technology. Both Zhou Yuhang and I are called responding authors. In multitask learning, different tasks have task-specific features. For example, in a popular publicate dataset, UCI, when predict marital status, we mainly use features of family members under 18 and family relationships. While predict income, we mainly use features of work class, occupation, and education. Existing methods, MMOE and PLE, use original features of all tasks to train all experts and only apply attention mechanisms after experts. They do not distinguish task-specific features before experts. To tackle the challenge, we propose a novel multitask learning model called Prototype Feature Extraction, PFE, as shown in the figure, which learns disentangled features to better model shared information and then balances the often shared information and the task-specific experts for multiple tasks. We introduce prototype feature centers to better extract prototype features by assigning features to each center. By measuring the distance between each sample's original features and these prototype feature centers, we can obtain disentangled prototype features to represent each sample. Each prototype feature is learned from a cluster of similar features. Comparing with previous models, which just concatenate original features or model, can better distinguish task-specific features. Here are our three major contributions. We propose a novel multitask learning model, namely prototype feature extraction, to obtain disentangled prototype features of each sample as shared information. PFE learns prototype features and prototype feature centers iteratively and combines extracted prototype features and task specific experts for multitasks. We study PFE on two public datasets, the AliExpress dataset and UCI dataset. Experimental results demonstrate that PFE outperforms corresponding single task models and the state-of-the-art MTL models. We extend and deploy PFE on a novel multitask recommender scenario in one of the world's largest short video sharing platform, Kuaishou, whose online and offline results show the effectiveness of our method. Motivated by some feature extraction strategies applied in graph convolution networks, we propose a novel prototype feature extraction for multitask learning. To extract features, we propose a concept of a prototype feature center. Suppose that there are air latent group of features. We introduce air prototype feature centers to disentangle the feature space. We define C as the prototype feature centers. The problem turns to be one of learning these centers and assignments to these centers. Motivated by EM algorithm for clustering, we propose a two-step algorithm to solve this problem. The probability that the output of I shared expert belongs to the G prototype features clusters and cluster centers are learned iteratively. To verify the performance of our algorithm, we compare with some baseline model including the shared bottom model and OMOE model. Moreover, we implement some state-of-the-art methods, including MMOE and PLE for comparison. Besides, we also train single task models for all tasks separately to check that our PFE can solve the negative transfer problem. 
Moreover, we conduct ablation studies on all data sets. PFE without prototype features uses traditional experts to directly learn from the original features. Comparison between that and PFE can demonstrate the effectiveness of the proposed model. We take AUC score as our evaluation metric. For task one, we report the best AUC and the mean AUC of all experiments for comparison. For task two, we report the AUC score when task one performs the best and the mean AUC score for all experiments. Here is the experimental results for early express data set. Each country is regarded as an independent experiment. In all five countries, our PFE achieves the highest AUC among all compared algorithms in terms of the best AUC and the mean AUC of the mean task. Here is the experimental results for UCI dataset. In the two groups of the experiments, our PFE achieves the highest AUC among all compared algorithms in terms of both the best AUC and the mean AUC. We also extend our model to a real-world industrial application. In short video fields, there exist two types of roles, producer and consumer. For producer, Camera tools are widely used in leading short video sharing platform nowadays. These powerful tools can help producers take pictures or videos and add special effects with internal templates. In general, producers will click a template, take a picture or record a video and save it. Only the template clicked by the producer could be exposed and subsequently used for recording. Similarly, only the template used for recording has an opportunity to be saved. The problem becomes predicting click-through rate, namely CTR, record-through rate, namely RTR, and save-through rate, namely STR, of each template for a given producer. Here is the structure of extended PFE model for template ranking. We deploy the PFE model with a wide and deep framework. Deep side features are fed into the downstream PFE and task specific experts, while the wide side features are concatenated with the output of the gate based networks as the input of the CTR, RTR, STR models to predict samples labels. This ranking system contains an offline training model and an online survey model. We collect an industrial data set from Quasho by sampling the dumped producer behavior logs during nine days for offline experiments. The dataset contains about 320 million samples and 6 million producers. We utilize the first seven days for training and last two days for testing. In offline experiments, we report the AUC performances on CTR, RTR, and STR tasks with the highest average UAUC of each algorithm. Our PFE outperformance others in this industrial scenario as well. In online experiments, we deploy it on a real-time data engine with 20% serving traffic for 10 days. The A-B test shows the number of works said the per producer has increased by 1.24%. That's all for today's sharing. Thank you.